this is the bit I've really been waiting for today because this is what today is all about. We have five top winners here. We also have a best in show to give. But I'm gonna start with one of the best five of today's show. Right, okay, have a little word. What is your name, sir? Uh, Damien. Damien, tell me a bit about your Mustang. Oh, where do I start? Uh, when did you buy it? I uh, bought it in 2007 in Cork in Ireland. Uh, she was originally blue, uh, then she got written off in a fire. So I stripped her to a bare shell and built what you see now. That's the first car I ever built. And um, yeah, it seems to have been all right. People quite kind of like it. All I can say is congratulations and thank you for coming all the way from Heathrow today. Well deserved. Thanks, Damien. The next car in the top five winners here with the owner of the Ford High Boy like to come forward and claim his prize. Hi. Congratulations. Fantastic. Can you tell me a little bit about the car? Yeah, I've owned the car now for about 11 years. I found it languishing in a garden over in Bexley Heath in North Kent. I love it to bits and, um, and have a great day out today, of course. Congratulations. Brilliant. Lovely to see you. I have here a Chevy pickup truck. And what is your name? Curly, we have Curly. Tell me a little bit about this vehicle. Um, I've had it about seven years, three and a half years, uh, restoring it, putting it on the road and that. Yeah, lovely bits here, lovely truck. Yeah. Yes. Thank you very much for coming, Curly. Brilliant, thank you. I have a name on here that I recognise. Ian Carnell, well done. Ian, come, come and tell us a little bit about your 57 because it is pretty damn spectacular. Uh, it's got a 350 Edelbrock crate motor supercharged, uh, 510 horsepower, rebuilt 350 TH auto box, uh, torque tube, 9 inch forward rear end, and will with disc brake set. And it's beautiful. Lovely. Congratulations, Ian. Brilliant. Last in the top five and again it's a name that i recognize it's toby taylor <laughs> hey. congratulations toby come and come and tell us a little bit about this model t of yours because it's kind of been on the scene on and off quite some years now last year i got it back on the road i've had it since the 1980s and I'm enjoying every minute of it now. Yeah. Yeah. This, this, this is just brilliant. Thank you. Oh, brilliant, Toby. Thanks ever so much for coming today. It's Thank wonderful. You. Thank you. This is our best in show prize today. It is a Ford. It's a 1934 in the most wonderful colour of tangerine. Would the winner of the best in show hailing 2015 like to step forward, please? What is your name? Mike. Mike. Okay, Mike, tell us a little bit about this car. Um, bought it about five years ago. Um, we stripped it down in the garden, trashed it in the garage, body down the shop, and me and my son completely rebuilt it besides the tank guys. That's it. Well, it's beautiful and it is so, so well deserved. is an award. There's an award that is given out to the club, to the Victory Wheelers, to somebody who has supported the club and done a lot for the club over the last year. And this person I think might be a little bit surprised. I hope he is. He's somebody that has headed up the cruises over the year, who has worked extremely hard to make sure that we all follow the directions. <laughs> He's not even looking in this direction at the moment, it's lovely. Someone who has really been there 
I'm just going to say it. Malcolm, would you like to step forward and please receive the Big Al Trophy? This trophy was produced for Alan Partridge in memory of how many years ago now, Trevor? We four or five years ago. So it gives me great pleasure and great honour, Malcolm, to hand this over to you. Okay. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Um, I'd just like to stop you just for one more second, please, if I could. Um, to thank all these fantastic guys for doing such a wonderful job today. Um, I'm from Hannah's Holiday Home Appeal and for those of you who don't know what we do, um, we give free holidays to children with cancer and life limiting illnesses. We've got three holiday homes, one in, the, one in Hailing Island just up the road at Park Dean, one in the New Forest and one at Milford on Sea. Um, over the years, these guys have sponsored four children and their whole family to go on holiday. And today alone, you guys have sponsored another sick child and their whole family to go along today. So I'd like to thank you all very, very much. Thank you.